Oh, what did you try to do? Look, we're still. <clears throat> Don't well. know, it's all right. <laughs> so nice. Yeah. Merry Christmas, everyone. Good morning. Alfie and I are heading out. This morning, I um, have only really managed to wash my face and that's about it. We're gonna go and grab some breakfast from somewhere or coffee or something and I'm gonna deliver. Whoa! Goodness, you tried it out! That tickled me. Those are boxes. Oh, guys, <laughs> just let you know, those are boxes that you see. You know what you just saw? They're boxes. Let me finish. They are boxes from the presents I've just wrapped. So I will sort them out when we get back. But for now, we are going to do a little present drop to the rest of the girls in the team whose presents hadn't arrived when we went to Tully's the other night. So, here they are, all wrapped up. It's about if eat chocolate for breakfast. I eat chocolate for breakfast quite a lot. Could you tell me what this is that's come up at the side here? What's that? I'm on manual focus. I don't know how I did that, but I probably wasn't in focus then for a very long time. What? What? Chocolate is just so good. I'm gonna have yeah, one. I was gonna say, I eat chocolate for breakfast quite often, which I think is a sign that you are addicted to sugar. It's probably not the best thing. But um, yeah, we are about to head out, drop some presents off, grab a coffee, start the day, fun times. You look like him. <laughs> Stopping to get a little coffee from Flower Pop. Whoa, so is that the left coffees. lane? Yeah. That little one? Yeah. I don't get think it, my car can even fit in there. Yeah, you can. What, this? Yeah. Um, do you need the address? Shall I put it in? Uh, yeah, that'd be good. Pretty little siren now for what they've done. There were three wise men. Well, I think this area is understated. Understated, underrated. Underrated. But I feel like property around here Drive west will be very nice. Miles. You know? Yeah. I know. You're not listening to me, are you? No. Didn't think so. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> you just said, I know. I was putting in the. What do you think I, I said? do two things at once. What do you think I said? Something about living around here would be lovely. I said, yeah, living around here, I said property around here is yeah. underrated. Oh, this hot chocolate's good. It's milky. I feel like I've drunk quite a lot of hot chocolates this December. It's been great. Yeah. I mean, I had a cho hot chocolate last night at 1.30 a.m. in bed That's from probably not McDonald's. The best. Probably not the best. You were just doing your typical Zoe, leave the camera rolling, but you have nothing to say. You literally just roll for so long. Honestly, I can't be bothered to lean forward and turn it off. I'm far back, I've reclined my seat, I've got my hot chocolate. You've got your chauffeur driving you. I've got my chauffeur. I'm really excited for them to open these presents, but I just said to Larissa, I was like, when are you gonna open it? Thinking she would open it today. She was like, Christmas day, I was like, oh. <laughs> oh, do you... even, even though I am that person oh, really? that opens presents on Christmas Day, I never open anything before Christmas Day. I had people I gave to out from I can't speak. People that I work with that I gave presents, I said to wait till Christmas Day. Oh. Because I think it's just more, especially this year. I think it's more special opening on Christmas. Yeah, I'm just impatient. Whoa, that car's been rear-ended. <laughs> that car's had anal. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at it. Really sorry now for what they've done. There were three wise men just trying to have some fun, yeah. Is that a good impression? Look who's alone now, wishing on me. 
It's not You'll know it'd be a good impression if this video gets copyrighted. <laughs> and then you're like, no, guy, no, 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 that was that, just me. That actually <laughs> happened once to me and Mark singing a song in a car. No. Yeah, and there was no um, back. We were just singing it, and it got copyrighted as a cover. <laughs> that is, a, that is a compliment. Yeah. Um, that that song always reminds me of Bryn singing um, James Blunt in the car in Gavin and Stacey. Whoa. That car park is busy. It will be TK Maxx. Yeah, it could be Nando's and Burger King. Oh, maybe. Well, that's quite early for a Nando's, 11 o'clock. Maybe it's nah. TK Maxx. I'd, I could eat a Nando's right now. The weather can't make up its mind today. One minute it's peeing down, the next minute it's sunny. Those three wise men. I can't stop singing it. <laughs> this is where we used to go. Do you know where for? Nala's. Puppy training. Puppy training. Yeah. And what else? Just down here on the left? Uh, was it in there, the puppy training? What did we buy just down here on the left? My mini? Yeah. I like quizzing you. <laughs> I'm very, I have a very good memory. What else is just down here on the left? Two things. Rock climbing. Yeah. Bouldering. Mm -hmm. And... The other one you might not know so much. You've never been, but I used to go a lot. Back in the old house, I used to go. Underground gym. Yeah, you are good. Yeah. I forget how good you know Brighton. Also, yeah, that's going to be. Think about it. I've lived here now for. Oh shit! What? Okay, I've just got to commit now. Oh, you were going to. <laughs> you were going I'm going, to going the wrong all way. The places that I, was I can just go. I can about. go along here, so it's fine. I've lived in Brighton now for. 2014 I moved here, didn't I? Six so, years. Six years. Do you think if I lived... You can go. If I lived somewhere else that wasn't as cool as Brighton, but was slightly cooler than <laughs> where you lived was before... Rock? Hey, where I lived was cool. <laughs> there was cool, there's just nothing to do. Yeah. Do you reckon you would have moved? Uh, depends if I loved Or do you the think place. we would have both moved somewhere else? I don't know. What about I just... if I lived in, like, you know when I live with Casper in London? Yeah, no. If I stayed in London, but I was like, look, we can move in together to somewhere nice, me and you, but no. in Shoreditch. No. Like, come on, Zoe, like... move to Shoreditch. Oh, Mitty have liked... moved across the road. Oh, I and... liked visiting you. Oh, no, they've always had two. They've always been two. I liked visiting Shut you in London. Shut up, one second. What brand of van is that? Which one? These. River Vale? I don't know. What is that? I don't know. They're I need different. to reverse up. Oh my goodness. No, because I'm looking for a van at the moment. Yeah, of course you are. Well... Can you see that? that I don't know what, what brand, brand is that. that is. No Can idea. Can you take a picture? There's no one behind me. Oh, there's someone coming. Okay. And these ones? Oh, bloody hell. Do you know why? Why? They're all electric. Are they? Yeah. How do you know? They just look electric. <laughs> you don't know for sure. You're telling me the front, look at that bumper. That's yeah, an electric okay. car. Oh my gosh. Um, From 249.99 excluding VAT. Just yeah, probably forever. a month. Uh, no, 250 pound for the VAT. No, I don't think so. I'm gonna buy one now, one minute. Let me see how much they are. Do you reckon they do contactless? 250 quid for a van. It's obviously not £250. I'm going to buy two of them. Just drive. <laughs> what was I saying? I liked visiting you in London, but it felt like... Being serious though, those vans did look very cool yeah, when they, they were did. electric. Yeah, they did. I do need to find out what... I've never seen those in my life before. And I've looked into a lot of vans. Anyway, as I was saying... Whoa. She is hot. <laughs> as I was saying... I wouldn't have moved to London because I... I look don't... how muddy that little boy is. No, no, seriously, look at him. Wait, wait, I'm going to wait here. Oh, he's getting in the car. Even his face... I saw, I saw. Even his face is muddy. He's like head to toe mud. That is so fun. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Um, I'm not going to... I can't even remember what I was saying. No, when I... When I, I would never London, have moved to London. Yeah. Whoa, look at that. But I fell in love with Brighton when I fell in love with you. I feel sick. 
Tesla. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Hello, Tesla driver. He literally like went. Hey, you're part of the club. Yeah. That makes my butthole cringe when that happens. What, when you said you fell in love with me at the same time you fell in love with Brian the same? No. Do you know what would be so weird? If we ever broke up and I'm just like living in Brighton. Wouldn't it? Would you still hang out with my family? Yeah. No, you wouldn't. Yeah, your family have told me that they would still hang <laughs> out with They'd hang out with you instead of me. Yeah, they would. We'd break up and they'd be like, oh, we can't really see you anymore because it's going to be awkward when Zoe's over. <laughs> and I'd be like, oh. That is so true. Wouldn't that just be so weird? Like every day I would like just call, speak to Poppy every day. Yeah. Like if you've got a new girlfriend. No, I, f I genuinely feel like, I mean, obviously it's easier said than done. If we ever broke up, I feel like we'd still. <clears throat> Don't well, cry, it's all right. <laughs> <clears throat> I, um,. I genuinely feel like we'd still be friends. I can't be friends with exes. Yeah, but that's only because your exes have cheated on you. <laughs> yeah, my exes have all been pretty <laughs> shit. That's, that's not because you broke up amicably. I don't know though, I just, I don't know if I ever could. I've never experienced it, so it's hard to imagine it. But. Now enter the roundabout and take the first exit. We have a dog, like we have a lot of responsibilities together, so it would be Well, that's where you're wrong. Because I paid for Nala, so I actually had the Okay, top. well, if we're getting into things we've each paid for, the road is blinding. It's golden. No, it actually is blinding. So many people don't wear the mask over their nose. Yeah, you know, that somewhere, annoys me. I saw I'm just a like, graphic that was like, wearing the mask, uh, wearing your mask under your nose is the same as wearing a pair of pants and only having your balls in there. <laughs> Okay, and your penis hanging away. over the, <laughs> over the top. <laughs> that, that, oh, that's <laughs> just so gross. Think of that visual. <sighs> Imagine if I didn't leave it <laughs> in the right house. <laughs> yeah, that would be wild. Imagine. Imagine. Mm. Is that good? Also, the guy knew the dealio. I gave him mental nut. You nudge. wanted a specific one. And he knew. And it was the one with the with the thing stuck with in the it. prong in it. Because <laughs> it was the biggest one with the most on the top. And I was like, come on bro, you know. You know. And then he just looked at me, he's like, I got you, don't you worry. Um, Pulled the she... thing out. Gave me that big guy. Last one. And then we're done. Let me get the package out. Hello. Oh, I thought you turned it off. No, I said you you just love leaving your camera rolling. I'm a documentary maker, don't you know? Oh, you're not vlogging, you're making documentaries. Yeah. Documentary mess. <laughs> Are we heading straight home? Yeah. Baby, baby. Who remembers when Alfie got S Club to go? We were literally just talking about that. Like, how wild is that? That was, that just was the, so sick. That was the best surprise ever. Um, we're back in the car. <laughs> Looks like all we've done today is be in the car. Went back, edited my video, put that up, ready to go. And now we're heading out for a little sunset beach walk with Poppy, Sean, Steve, and Alexia. Hopefully, there's going to be a good sunset, but there's quite a lot of cloud. Now it's quite a thin cloud, though. Yeah. Over there it's not. I think it's going to be banging. Okay, well let's, fingers crossed, we've got a great banging sunset. I'm excited. Oh, can't put these back on. Is it raining? Let's what? just pretend it's not. Oh my god, it's raining! I think we're raining. under one cloud. No, I think we're under one cloud. Oh. It's raining. Look, watch, I've got my foot down a little bit. It's just drop raining. Okay. Well, I have faith in you, weather. Hey 
It's so nice. that they spent with us. Uh, well, you've got that cork. That's right, five-year anniversary. <laughs> and champagne. And so in Yeah. Yeah, And then, do you remember I fell asleep? Yeah. <laughs> I had like four yeah, sips and yeah, fell asleep. Yeah, champagne, you I'm out. Yeah. I just can't really drink oh, much champagne. You. I'll literally have the tiniest, drink, yeah. tiniest, because I'm driving. We need to share this with no, it's all right. I just have the tiniest bit. Perfect, Steve. Yeah. That's yeah. <laughs> that that little taster. I can't feel my hands anymore. Woo! All right, guys. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone. Are we allowed to cheers? Cheers, cheers. I can cheers out. Cheers, cheers, cheers. cheers. Delicious. Is it good? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Champagne is literally the only drink that I like the taste of. It, it's a good one to like that. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> of all the drinks. Oh, that is good. Home. That was so nice to just be outside chilling um, and chatting and catching up. So, just before we left, I had a little asos delivery i actually went on it looking for a couple of last minute bits and pieces for people for christmas and i ended up just searching in the christmasy section because i just feel like <laughs> it's been a lot harder to get festive this year i don't know about you but as much as i'm trying to force it I just feel like my soul doesn't feel Christmassy. Like I'm not wearing Christmas jumpers. I'm not wearing my little Christmas hats. Um, so I was like, I'm just gonna look at the Christmas section and see if they've got any like fun jumpers or like just fun Christmas bits. Um, and then I just got a bit carried away. I thought I would share with you what I did pick up. Some of it isn't Christmassy at all because I started looking at the Christmassy section and then obviously just ended up looking at everything that was like new in. This one is Christmassy. This is a Wham t-shirt. It says last Christmas. Just thought that tucked into a pair of jeans. <laughs> it's like slightly more festive. So I love that. It's got George Michael on it. There he is. One of my favourite Christmas songs. Um, what's that? <gasps> also got this one. Home Alone t-shirt. <laughs> Again, just thought tucked into jeans, roll the sleeves up, something a bit different. I feel like these are pyjamas. Yeah, these are like very light pink pajamas um, with like frilly, frilly wide leg. Um, and I think you could get it. So that's the bottoms. This is the top. How cute is this? It's like cropped, but the sleeves are frilly. I feel like in that time between Christmas and New Year, just live in pajamas, so. 
thought I would get those. They're actually a little bit thinner. They're probably more like spring pajamas, to be honest. But nice to be prepared. Oh, I've got two new face masks. Don't know if they'll fit me, but I liked them. So this one is um, like a leopard. This one's just like a plain brown. Nope. Why is my head so freaking small? <sighs> I might have to give these to Alfie. Does anyone know where I can get <laughs> face masks that are a bit smaller that might fit me? <laughs> I really seem to have gone in on the animal print. Oh, this is a dress, I remember this. I thought this would be really nice with boots. Um, so it's like puff sleeves, and then it's kind of like a tiered midi dress. But I thought that was really nice. And then this one, also animal print. I think this is a jumpsuit. Yeah, petite button jumpsuit in animal print. I basically need to learn how to dress again that like that in stuff that isn't um loungewear <laughs> oh i like this so it's a jumpsuit wide leg buttons down the front very nice lovely that will be lovely for spring why am i buying clothes for spring <laughs> oh this was nice roll neck cream jumper and matching skirt skirt jumper combo nice bitch i am the gift <laughs> uh, i actually really like the retro santa um but then that did make me lol so i got that and what size did i get I think they only had this size left, um, but I thought I could wear it baggy. Oh, this goes with the PJ set. Oh, I bought two. Oh, so it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a three piece pajama set. So you've got the top and then you've got the short kind of cut off trousers. And then these ones are like tighter, like flared ones. So I guess it's whatever takes your fancy. And then this is like stylish, somewhat put together loungewear because you've got this top, like that little crop. I might put this on tonight actually. And then you've got the trousers, like that. And then you've got The cardigan to go over the top so again another like little three-piece loungewear set which i thought was quite nice something a bit different i bought like a jumper dress obviously not really to wear now because it would be a flipping freezing unless you were going to wear tights or leggings but I quite liked it. It looked really cool on the model. She had like knee high boots on, I think, or like chunky trainers, I can't remember. And the back, I thought was quite cool. Um, so yeah, I really liked that. And then one more thing, another jumpsuit. I do like a jumpsuit. Collar smock jumpsuit in this like spotty, I just really, I think I really liked the collar on this one. Something a little bit different. Little short sleeves. And wide leg, three quarter length. Trouser bit. And that is my haul. That I did late one evening when I wasn't feeling in the Christmas spirit. <laughs> and actually, only two of those things were Christmassy. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, you want daddy to look after you as always. Oh no. I need another baby. Don't want to look after you. Don't want me 
Bye.